We are back, and we have the hunter on Nez Perce Valley doing a realistic hunt for some mule deer. This is not mule deer. This is uh, white tail, but uh, I saw this albino, and I'm pretty sure, which is weird, but I'm pretty sure she is from uh, our last video, which is interesting. Hello. Uh, can you move, tree? You're in my way. Oh, my stars. This herd is insane. I know we're not here for whitetail, but I gotta take them. Question is, which one do we which one do we take? There's so many. There's an albino. There's one, two, three, at least. And I think that's the fourth one. I think that's the biggest boy right there. I was really going this way because I haven't been up here before. And I thought maybe I might run into some mule deer back here. Take a little nap. Oh my gosh, that guy is huge. Hi. I want to leave you alive for a while, I think. I just want to see if you can carry down your genetics, even though you're just an albino. I wonder if it's possible. I really want to take this guy out. How's my wind? Is my wind terrible? No, my wind's good. They are just dead locked onto me. Okay, they're good. Go back, go back to chilling. I'd like to take them with a bow. The reason being is because I don't know if... Uh, there's mule deer nearby. Okay, we're good. We're golden. We're golden. I'm gonna sit right here. I, again, I know this is not a mule deer, but I can't pass up that guy. That guy's huge. I was not gonna pass up the white, I mean, the, uh, the, uh, albino. Um, but I, I saw that big guy, and now I have to get that guy. So we're gonna try to call him in and take him out with a bow, because I would absolutely love to have a five-star with a bow. I really think this guy's gonna be a five star. I'd like to get get him a little closer so I can count the tines. If we can get to this tree right here, I know for guaranteed I can take this shot. I could probably take that shot. It's just a little iffy. Might have to give one more call here. Just maybe. We're gonna take it. Did I miss? I missed. Obviously, I'm gonna find this guy and we're gonna take him out. I think I got him. I think he's up here. Alright, we got two this time. Um, which kinda sucks. The only reason I say it kinda sucks is the big guy right there is in the back. This guy's gonna get to me first, and possibly spook. And if he spooks, he might spook the other guy. And I'm hoping he doesn't. But that guy right there is definitely the one we want to take. There's technically three coming in, it sounds like. My problem right now is figuring out the wind and how it affects the arrow. If I can figure that out, I think golden on, on uh, being able to hunt with a bow. Yeah, that's exactly what I was afraid of. Okay, we're gonna aim to the right a little. <laughs> yes, let's go, boys. Nailed it. We nailed it right in the chest. Oh, wow, it wasn't in the chest, so I lunged him. Wow, it carried really far. Do you guys see where I aimed? I aimed right here. It carried that far and that distance? That's insane. Alright, what do you guys think this guy is? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. He's definitely a 14 point. Majestic. I say he's a 5. Ooh, boys! Let's go. 93% mature, 5 star, with a bow. We did it. Taxidermy, that sucker. Alright, now it's time for some mule deer. <laughs> There's the first guy. There's the second guy right there. Okay, I need to see both of you guys at once. I might have to let them walk away and call them back. 
because I think uh, I need to get in a better position where our wind's not an issue. I don't think it's going to be too bad. Oh, I thought he was farther down that way. Uh, neither one of these guys are big. I mean, they're big. They're not, like, massive, though. He's still kind of young. So I think this is the guy I'm going to take. Yeah, we'll let that guy... I have no idea if I can take this shot right now. It's going to be blowing from this side, so I need to aim this way. Drop them, boys. Wait, that guy didn't spook? What in the heck is going on with my hand? Oh, he did spook. Why didn't I hear him spook? Alright, I'm going to call this. This guy's going to be a three. I wonder where we shot him. Had him in a lung. Oh, that was so close. Okay, wow. We aimed too far to the left, I think. We're getting it. We're getting it down, though. Yeah, this guy's not even going to be a three, I don't think. I think this guy's a two. Oh, he is a three. Okay. 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 Not bad for a first mule deer of the day. I did a massive loop. I, uh, you know, we were over here last. And I worked my way all the way around, came down this side, and looped in because my wind is blowing this direction. So, I wanted to be downwind, and of course I have bugged myself. I do this every time. I need to report this bug. I keep forgetting. Because I don't even know if they know about it. I think they're around the other side of that hill up there. That's my guess. We have hunted this herd before. I think this is the herd with the, uh, the melanistic that we had. If you guys haven't seen that video, I'll post it up in the top right corner. Go check it out. Got ourselves a melanistic mule deer. It was pretty cool. What? Where? You're super close. Hi. You're not... You are. I was about to say, you're not very big, but you are. I'm very hesitant to take this shot. Because I feel like there's three... And if I take the shot and, like, this absolute monster walks over the hill, I'll be upset. If there's an absolute monster, he didn't show up, so it's fine. We'll, uh, take what we can get. I think this guy might be a four. Uh, I don't know. He might be a three. He's pretty tall, but I just don't think he's... I just don't think he's got it. Yeah, he's three. All right, all right. So two threes, not bad. Two threes and a five-star whitetail. I mean, I'll take it either way. Now, I gotta be careful here because those mule deer, if they are here, should be like right here somewhere because their feed zone's pretty close. Our wind is still good, so that's fantastic. I, I don't see anything right now, so... They... I so they might not be here, but, uh, never mind. They're 140 yards out. Let's go ahead and give a giant call here. I'm a little late, but I think it's fine. Hi, wolves. I hunted you last episode. Wish you would have been here then. Oh, yep, looks like we're getting one in. Oh, yeah. Definitely getting one in. Hello? <laughs> Hear him, but I don't see him. Please be absolutely monstrous. Please? Nah. You're a tiny sucker. Is it just you? Or are there two? All right, all right. There's two. It's fine. It's fine. Slowly bringing them back in. They didn't go very far. Man, these guys are getting pretty close. I hope they both come in at the same time and not one by one again so I can see both of them. I need to know what the other one is. 
See, I didn't know where they ran to. So if I would have known they were right in front of me now, I would have crested this hill first. Because then I could have looked down into the valley and probably been able to see them a lot better. Here we go. Here we go. I still don't see anything yet, though. And they're super close. Alright. I think this is the big boy. We're gonna have to take this for he spooks. Let me see if he really was the big boy. Was smokes the other one took off so fast. I don't know if he's the big boy or not, but it's fine. Hard shot him left lung and man right rung uh, runged him. Uh, right runged him. <laughs> right lunged him. I say he's gonna be a three. Oh he's a two. Okay. Interesting. Why was he 78% and he's only a two? I don't know the percentages and I don't really care about knowing them, but I feel like our last guy was like a 75 and he was a three. Maybe I'm wrong. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please head down and hit that subscribe button. I really do appreciate it. While you're at it, smash that like button. Leave a comment. I'd like to hear from you guys. Hope you guys have a fantastic day. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. OCG out.